All right, we've got a few more questions coming up here. And the first is, what is the first step in the recruiting process and when should I start it? Um, you can never really start too soon as far as kind of researching the schools that you want to pursue, possibly getting understanding of what you need to do to be a desirable candidate for that coach. Um, and then also understanding what it takes to become a college golfer, not only to get there, but then the time commitment and everything that goes along with it. So um, I think there's a lot of questions that you can be asking a lot of different people and trying to, to get um, you know as much information as you can and starting as, as early as you can. Um, the next two questions are kind of tied together is when do I need to be committed by and if I'm entering in my to my senior year but haven't done much, is it too late? And they're somewhat related, but at the same time, they're not. Um, you know, it's really hard to say about when do you need to be committed by. Like, I stress to the families that I work with and talk to, like, you have to worry about your own journey and not be caught up in what everybody else is doing. And so you really need to figure out what makes sense for you from um, a commitment standpoint and what the school that you're talking to um thinks as well. So every program works differently when it comes to recruiting, especially when it comes to a timeline. Um, and so just kind of having an understanding with that when you talk to coaches, it's okay to ask, you know, what kind of timeline are you working on? And they might ask you the same thing. So, um, you know, I can't stress it enough to not get caught up in what everybody else is doing and really just focus on your situation. I know it can be hard to do, but it's truth. So, um, and as far as like where you are in the process as a senior, um, again, it depends on the situation and, and where you're trying to play. I mean, there are opportunities out there that if you want to play college golf, you can, you can play. It's just a matter of finding it. And if it matches up with what you're looking for, both academically and athletically, um, you know, I've heard of people signing as late or committing as late as April and May of their senior year. Um, I'm not going to say you should hold off until then, but um, there are opportunities out there. Um, golf has become a super competitive sport. I mean, it's always been competitive, but there's just fewer opportunities than ever because there are more kids playing. Um, and so, you know, again, you just have to, it depends on the situation. I hate that it's kind of a vague answer, but it really does depend on the situation and what kind of improvement you're making. I mean, you could make a significant improvement in your golf game as a senior and a coach may feel like you could help them. And so um, they might add you late. Uh, but I think if you are a senior and you're just starting, like you really need to be aggressive and, and also just understand that, you know, maybe those dream schools that you're thinking of probably aren't an option at this point, and you just need to figure out what's going to be the best fit for you, both academically and athletically.